What's going on everyone, e Pacmans is back with another Fortnite video and today we are looking at the World Collide missions as you can see up on the screen but like usual before we begin with the challenges if you guys want to head over to the item shop and make sure you have my code e Pacmans in press accept and support a creator which is myself I'd greatly appreciate you guys as always, thank you so much but now what we're here for, Worlds Collide, this is week three, although there are four of these missions, as you guys can see I have prestige these other ones, but right now we are at week three, Worlds Collide. So for the first three missions, they don't seem too bad, it's use a rift, visit a rift zone, deal damage to opponents at a mountain top village, mountain top viking village or loot lake. So this doesn't look too difficult. I think we're going to go ahead and hit this right away. Alright, so for those of you that don't know, Retail Row is back. And I'm pretty sure that's going to be where we find this rift zone. So there we go. We visited a rift zone. Like I said, Retail Row is back. So we might as well come and check it out again. I miss Mikoro. I miss some of these classic uh, places, honestly, guys. I wish they would just bring back the old map. Here we're using this rift, so the easiest way to find a rift for sure is just visit Loot Lake and just go to this big orb, and that's a rift right there, guys. So, two things you can knock out really easy in one game Rift Zone and then use a rift. And while you're here, you might as well get the damage too, right? Alright guys, so now we have to visit a memorial to a cube in the desert or by the lake and then eliminate opponents in the desert. And I do want to note that I did, I was able to deal damage to opponents at Loot Lake as you guys saw previously. However, since I did quit the game, it did not count. So you have to finish the game for it to count, apparently. Um, which I had no idea and it sucks because I would have probably already completed that, but it's alright. Alright, so now I'm going to show you guys where the cube memorial is, and that's going to be in the desert here. Well, one of them is at least. The one I'm going to show you guys. So, that's going to be right over here, top of this mountain, right here. So you see that's about H8, H9-ish. I'll zoom in again, right north of this little river. You guys can see other people are blanded here as well. So here we are, guys. Alright, we're gonna land at Loot Lake to hopefully deal the damage to opponents and search the chests. It's gonna be tough, but we'll see if we can do it. We got chest number one here. We got a grappler too to make it to the other ones. We got chest number two. Ooh, we got a heavy sniper. I don't mind if I do. Okay, let's see if we can find another chest here. 
Oh yeah, we do. You see it up there? Yes, we do. This is considered a loot lake for sure. Let's see if we get it. And there we go, we got three out of three chests. Oh, we got it. <laughs> we got the guy in the mecha. That was 375 headshot damage. That is insane. I kind of just quick scoped it too, so hopefully that counts. And like I said, a reminder: do not quit the game once you deal dealt your damage here at Loot Lake, because they will not count. And I speak from experience. Alright guys, so we got the victory here, and we should get credit for the damage dealt in Loot Lake. Remember that crazy headshot quick scope. So let's go see if we got credit. Wow, we apparently did not deal damage to opponents. Interesting, okay. That's, it might be broken then. Um... Wow, okay. So I guess we'll see how to do that. <laughs> Alright, so for the mushrooms, guys, my favorite spot is usually to land a sh by Shifty Shafts, I would say north of it. Just because all the mushrooms are always by the trees. Although I do have to say, I'm a little concerned the fact that I haven't been able to get the damage at Loot Lake, apparently. Which I'm not sure why, but we'll see if we can fix that later. Alright guys, um, I think I might have made a little mistake on my mark, it's a little more west than north that I had, than I had anticipated, but here's the mushrooms. We got a few here. Let's see if we can find any more around. There's usually, there was a lot over here before. Not sure if they took him away. Or... Regardless, shifty shafts is the way to go. By the trees right outside of it, you can get all the ten mushrooms in one game. Hopefully, we'll see if we can do it ourselves. So yeah, eight, nine, and then tens over here. So nice little quick mission. All right, so we're here at Loot Lake, guys, and I just dealt damage, at least some damage, but I don't think we're getting any credit for it. Which is concerning. Um, luckily right now the circle is in the desert area. So we're going to stick around here. And get my three elims. Okay, we got one desert elon. So we got two desert elons. So we got our third elon, and we got a blue right. Oh, there we go. That guy got him. All right, it's all right. We got our three elims, guys. I think we're safe to uh, quit the game here. So I'm just going to go ahead and guess that this challenge is not possible right now. I think it's probably glitched or something like that because it's not working. Um, any, da any damage that I've dealt at Loot Lake has not even counted. So I'm not sure 
uh, how to do this challenge right now at the moment. But anyways, you guys basically saw me do it. I mean, I can't really control what happens right now. Right now it seems to be glitched out. Um, but it's an easy challenge. I completed it in one quick scope headshot <laughs> for 359 damage. It was crazy. But anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this week's video. And if you did, make sure to drop a like. And if you aren't subscribed already, what are you guys doing? Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Turn on that bell button so you don't miss on any future posts like this one. And yeah, guys, I appreciate it if you guys share my videos. Um, like I said, I am, I've am i come back uh, to posting weekly. And I would really appreciate the support. All the support that you guys can give me, I really appreciate it. And then lastly, if you guys want to support me, epacmans is my supporter creator code. Go ahead and click accept. And I would greatly appreciate that. But other than that, guys, that is it for this week's video. I wish I could show you the completed uh, Worlds Collide here, but apparently this one's glitched out. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.